Welcome back to Teach Me How to Clean. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to clean out the inside of your washing machine with a dishwasher tab. I'm going to be running you guys through basically my step-by-step -step process on how I do this. This is the first time I'll be using a dishwasher tablet. Typically I use the, typically I would use a little tablet kind of like this but it's made specifically for cleaning out the inside of your washing machine on like a self-clean cycle. However, I'm out of those, so I'm gonna be using this dishwasher tab. It does say, full disclosure, that you should not use this for regular cleanings because it does have something in the detergent uh, in this dishwasher tab that can kind of mess up different things uh, in your washer and that can void the warranty on it. So do not do this regularly. This is what I'm going to be using today. Every once in a while, it is okay. So I'm not gonna ruin my, my washing machine by doing this once or twice or three times. Just don't be doing this, you know, once a month. You know, you understand? Okay. My washing machine takes a beating. My washing machine takes a beating. We have two long-haired dogs, a long-haired cat, plus three children. So this is basically running all the time. You can see the buildup we have up here. So you can kind of see the buildup we have going on in here. I'm going to scrape this with the back of a butter knife to kind of get the big chunks of hair and stuff off uh, all throughout the liner of my washing machine because that's really nasty and same like in here I'm gonna pull this back and get all the gunk and grime out of there as well. I'm gonna take the back end of my butter knife and just kind of run this along the drum of my washer. So you can, can see just how much stuff is actually coming off of the drum here. This is just dog hair and kind of random bits and pieces that come off of clothing, obviously. But I'm scraping all that off and getting it out. If you're looking for a way to do this a little bit more naturally, you could also sprinkle baking soda kind of up in the seal of your washer. It's a normal cycle and then once you hit the rinse cycle, go ahead and dump in probably about a cup of vinegar. And that'll really do the trick on getting rid of smells, odors, sanitizing, kind of all of that stuff. But I'm actually out of baking soda, so I could run this with just vinegar and it would do just as well. But for the sake of today's video, I'm gonna use a dishwasher tablet. This is all the gunk that I ended up pulling out of the seal of my washer. Not terrible, but definitely not great either. Just a lot of buildup and gunk. I also have a ton of buildup here on my door, so I'm hoping now that the seal of my washer is cleaned out, this will, uh, be able to get a little bit cleaner in this cycle we'll see but this is just a before shot and then i'll show you guys after i'm going to throw in my dishwasher tab and i've got one dishwasher tab back there and it says that you can use up to four so i'm going to use two half of i'm going to wash the dishwasher tabs in my washer on the longest and the hottest cycle switching my water temperature to hot and i'm going to turn it on my longest cycle which is my heavy duty cycle and I'm gonna start this. I'm gonna start this and I'll come back after the washer is finished and we'll see how well those dishwasher tabs really did on cleaning out the inside of my washer and also kind of getting rid of the smell and making it smell better because it definitely is a little ripe in there right now. So we are still in the wash cycle, but I wanted to show you guys what this is looking like on the inside here. So you can see it's super sudsy, lots of bubbles, definitely something's happening, which makes me excited. I don't think it's really gonna get to this part of my door, which makes sense because the water doesn't really hit here uh, that well. So I think I'm gonna have to actually just scrub the door, but I'm very excited to see what it's gonna do on the inside and like for the seal and everything of the washer. So. Just so you guys can see kind of what's happening on the inside here with all these bubbles and it makes me excited to think that it's actually um, going to do something here and not just kind of be a waste of dishwasher tabs. <laughs> now this is complete. I'm just taking a regular hand towel here and wrapping it around my hand and then kind of cupping it down into the seal here and running it through the seal to kind of get any of leftover gunk hair, anything that might have been loosened by that wash cycle and getting everything 
out. I finished wiping out the seal of my washer and now on my door I have some hard water stains up here and just some regular buildup. What I'm gonna do is take a dishwasher tab, dunk it in a little bit of water to activate it and then scrub all those spots on the door. This is what the door is looking like after just a couple seconds of scrubbing. I just took a wet washcloth and wiped it down and then I would go back in and follow up on these spots that are still kind of hard. That's how you wash your window door with a dishwasher tab for your washer.